Okay, everybody, I'm back, and now we're going to create our first pipeline report. So there's a lot we could do with reporting, but the purpose of this video is just to get you started so that you could start seeing your very first pipeline within Salesforce. <clears throat> so again, we're going to click Reports. Then we're going to go over here and click New Report. Then, because we're going to be building our pipeline, our pipeline is related to opportunities. So we're going to create the report type called Opportunities. And over here, you can see the preview of what that report could look like. Click Create. And then what you're going to see is you're going to see a preview of a possible pipeline report. Now, just like in my previous video, I too am hiding my pipeline because there's sensitive data in there. So I'm only going to show you the query window uh, within defining this report. But on your side, if you're going step by step with me, you should be able to see a preview of the whole report. So I'm going to select all opportunities because I want to see all opportunities that are in the company. If I wanted to see only my pipeline, I would click My Opportunities. So I'll click All Opportunities, where the Opportunity status is open, which means these are opportunities that are in the pipeline right now. They're not closed, and they're not closed one. They are open, which means that I'm working them. With a close date, now we could select any number of date. And what I would probably recommend here, just to keep it simple, is let's do for the current fiscal year. So I want to see all opportunities that are in the pipeline for the current fiscal year. Click Run Report. Now, you're going to run the report and you're going to see a pipeline or a report of all of the uh, opportunities that are in your pipeline that you're currently working. Now we can make some edits to this report and we could do so uh, by, I'm going to go back and I want to customize this report just a little bit. And when I customize the report, I'm just trying to fix this window here. What I want to do is I want to group it by stage. So I want to see all my opportunities within, or I'm sorry, by stage. So I would do that by going to Tabular Format, and then I would click Summary. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to move this window down just a little bit. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull my stage, and I'm going to drag it, and I'm going to group it by stage. Now you can see all my opportunities by stages, and you'll see how your, how your report is starting to group by each stage. Then what I want to do is I want to see a summary of how much is in each stage. So I'm going to click Amount. I'm going to scroll down to Summarize this field. And it's outside of my window here. So but what you should see is a pop-up box that says Amount. And there's four checkboxes, Sum, average, max, min. Let's create some. Click apply. Okay, then it starts going to, it's going to summarize all the opportunities by that stage. I'm going to click run report. Now what you should see is your report grouped by pipeline stage and at each stage it would have the amount, the total amount in that stage. Then I'll click Save As, give it a name. And then save it. And there you go.